am from Ocean State. Abuja. I'm from Cross River State. From Lagos State. I'm from Dewey State. I'm from Imo State. I'm from Eboy State. I'm from Kogi State. The IFAD Agrio Project, the Rural Youth Employment Opportunity, which is a support to agribusiness integrated ops in the country, is a project that is meant to run for five years between 2020 to 2024. And this project is a national project with gender equity focus. At the beginning of year one, we have been able to set up three ops in Nigeria, which is Oyo, Abuja, and Oweri Hub. The Oweri Hub is managed by Songhai, Abuja Hub is managed by APDC, and also the Oyo Hub is managed by IITA. I saw the call, of, the call for application around February, which I applied for it, and to God be the glory, and I'm among the beneficiaries today. It's been a great experience so far, it's been a great experience, and I never expected it would be as, as, as enormous, as elaborate, like the opportunities could be as deep as this actually. You know, so it's, 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 I was, I'm actually bewildered because it's more than my expectation. It's more than my expectation from every person that was here, from how the program was organized to the collaboration between IIT and other institutes and so much more. So it's utterly beyond my expectation. And with this experience, with the lead to, we've not really gone deep actually, but with the lead to experience that we've seen now, from what I have seen today, I think there are better prospects. There would be better prospects for every beneficiary. At the end of the training, I hope to see myself as someone who has about 80% practical skills in agriculture. With that 80% skill, I believe I'll be able to start up a business plan which I've been nurturing on my own for about three years now. So far, it's very, very interesting. Like yesterday, we started with cassava processing units. In as much as I've been seeing and hearing most of the things, but you know, when you're doing it yourself, there is this aspect, when you do it yourself, you know much better. So yesterday, we started from harvesting, bringing it out from the farm, peeling it itself ourselves, then doing the grinding and processing, and we made the gari yesterday. So it's very, very interesting. I think I know much better now. And when you are exposed to ask questions, you know, outside there, we meet people that are not that enlightened. They just know the practical. But when you meet experts, you ask them questions and they'll explain everything in detail to you. And you know better. Now I know better. You chose to become an entrepreneur, so that means that you are creating the opportunity for yourself. And what we are trying to do is to give you the capacity to realize that dream that you have. So we are playing that role of supporting you to achieve your potential. And I'm already seeing that you are achieving that potential. You are immersed in this program with passion. You are bringing your own knowledge. You are acquiring more knowledge. You are networking with your fellow the trainees so this is really a great beginning for all of you you have to maintain that passion you have to maintain that spirit because it's really what will carry you through the years as you are starting your business and growing that business you will need that spirit that spirit will take you in uh, to to lift you up when you fall because a business will fall from time to time we don't control the environment some of the things we try to control are the, our knowledge, but we don't control necessarily how the environment will change over the years. Recently, we were dealing with COVID. We are still dealing with COVID. That's something we didn't know. But business must continue to strive. Tomorrow, there will be something else, and we will continue to strive. So we count on you to maintain that spirit. Today, as I end my speech, I want to tell you that I congratulate you and I wish that you know that this is a lifetime opportunity for you and do not take it for granted. On behalf of IFADA Group Nigeria Project and all the implementation crew across the country and those that will come on board, we wish you success in your endeavors. Thank you very much.